Hey, and welcome back to another episode of Craft of the Camper. We are Sam and Deanne, and we are in the process of converting our VW Crafter into a tiny home on wheels. Could have been in some trouble there. We spontaneously bought Crafty last July in the first lockdown, and we hope to have them ready this summer to travel to Scotland. If that's the pain, the, the picture you want to paint it. Hold it st steady, mate. Christ, what, what on earth? In this episode, we fill in the screws from the cladding and Sam finishes the bed structure. That's fine, okay. We could be influencers in the next literally few weeks, and now we know where we live, so. So I'm not sure what video we're in here because things are getting a little bit of out of hand with the filming and like at what stage we're at with the van. So I'm just going to chuck this in somewhere. We pale this morning. So today, 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 today. Um, this is like a bit of an odd day where we're kind of waiting on bits to do like the bed, finish the bed and stuff. Um, so I'm kind of just like spuddling doing little things that need to be done that I don't really want to do. Um, God, steamy. I haven't actually filmed this but I didn't have the camera with me. Um, we've now done like a half kind of bulkhead or like a third bulkhead. Um, this kind of like breaks up the cab a little bit to the actual like living area if you like. The dilemma we had was obviously we'd I sort of made this and shaped it to the template that we bought and um, we really wanted to put this wall in but obviously I didn't want to pull this down so what I had to do is kind of like um, scribe this panel to fit this um, but yeah it's, um, it's smart it looks good um, so I've kind of just chucked a load of filler in over there and then hopefully sand it down and it's going to be painted anyway so you shouldn't notice any imperfections and then on this side, I don't know if you can see, um, but it's, I've carpeted it and then also I've put these two battens as well across it just to add structure. So you've got battens that go to the top here of the um, shelf and then down here it's also fixed to the floor. So it's really strong and also screwed down along there which actually is the like metal part of the van so yeah so after making this corner here I want to finish this off people leave this like right until last minute but I've actually got the template to to do it or at least I think I do um, so I'm gonna try and get that sorted now this side I didn't use a template I just sort of made it up but this bit here is actually gonna like go with the van so Good morning. What are we doing today? So we've decided not to go into the workshop today because we're, we're, we're not going to do a full day, which is amazing. We're actually going to have like a little half day. And I've brought stuff back to just do the, we're going to wood filler the screws in. So Sam built this bit yesterday. Built that bit in the week. I love it. It makes it look so, so good. Um, just on the dividers, as you can see. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. We got a little tea. Tea. I feel like we might need to take this out. Yeah, here. same enough. We're gonna break it. Oh look, there's Alan. Look. And there's a. Uh, did you see him? Yeah, I think he did. <laughs> so our neighbour Alan just <laughs> saw me film out the window, and I think we're right. Well, Alan's a hero. So sorry, Alan, if you saw sorry, us. Sorry, Alan. I was just being funny. He's gonna think like there's some creeps in the van. He doesn't know it's us though. So our house there, look. 
that's a private account. Okay. We're not gonna, we could be influencers in the next literally few weeks, and now <laughs> they know where we live, so that's that can't be fun, I'm afraid. <laughs> So cool now, like all the horrible screws are covered up. Oh no! What? Got some on my coat. Yeah, they were like saying just be careful yeah. when you buy when you buy a van. We don't even do those. Yeah, they're gonna be under the cabinet. Morning, all. Today we're getting back on the bed frame. Um, look at this hair, lockdown hair is looking good. So a lot has happened um, since we last put the bits in for the bed frame. We've fully cladded. Um, basically where this bed frame is here, the plan is, is to weld in, in place, um, these little right angled sections. I'm going to see how strong it is from then and may support it underneath if it's n if it's strong enough though I'm not going to bother yeah so that's the plan for today one thing I will say is when fillering it's just like my hair is so bad I mean it's literally like the messiest job absolute like wear a mask wear gloves wear goggles um, wood filler dust is horrible to be honest any, any filler dust is horrible but I think it's because you're in a confined space when you're doing, you know, internal shit. Yeah, so let's get on with this bed frame. died there but uh, making progress um, the cladding is like obviously getting burnt from where I've been welding which is so annoying but hopefully I just paint it up and it won't you won't see it and stuff um, but I've braced the back and the front and then also the middle and then what I'm going to probably do is weld a centre bit in here as well to mask up and then spray it. It's, it's not so bad when you're like... Well, you'd be up here, wouldn't you? Yeah. Oh, it's like a trampoline. I've literally gone overboard here. Um, yeah, primed and then going to paint after I've had a cup of tea. Shake it, wake it, bloody hey! hey. 
thanks for watching and see you in the next episode where we paint the inside of the van.